What's up, all you cool kids? This is Daisy Collins of TsunamiRose.net, coming at you live from my craft room here in Las Vegas, Nevada, as I do Monday through Friday, bringing junk journal content and videos. So if that's what you're into, please do subscribe. Give me a little thumbs up. That really help me out with my um, channel here in this video. And um, if that's what you're into, please do come and check out my channel. I do go live um, pretty much every single day showing you what I'm doing here in my craft room. Um, right now, I am, uh, this is the, this would be the fifth journal here. Miss Patricia, hello. I had a restart, girl, my bad. <laughs> I hadn't noticed that I didn't have um, my internet cable plugged in. I was just on Wi-Fi. And that never works out well. So I'm like, uh oh, I gotta go get my internet cable. I'm a mess. I'm a mess right now. That's why I haven't came online. <laughs> Hi, Ms. Vanessa. How are you? How is it going? Okay, so I got paper clips. I got this. I forgot I had this. It's like a little, like, uh, speech bubble, you know? I don't know. I think I got this at Ikea at some point. I'm just putting random paper clips. They're not all even. They're not going to be the same or anything. They're just random little paper clips. Oh, I have so many weird paper clips. I got to use them. So these ones are going to be a nice mix. And I already have to. I have to get more of my favorite um, teardrop. Okay, so paper clips are in. I'm working on adding the pockets. So you added this three layer pocket right there. Hi Liz, how are you? And then there's this pocket here. Each signature gets two paper clips and three pockets. So now I'm just looking for the spot for the last pocket. I guess this could be it right here. Um, that would be cute right here, actually. And you can see these pretty images right here. That would be interesting. Let's see. Let's see how that goes. So I have been working, but I've, I've been working really slowly. <laughs> I've been working at a snail's pace, but you know what? That's okay. There's no race. <laughs> I have not been in the mood to do Christmas stuff, though. I said I was going to do Christmas stuff, and I just have not. <laughs> I have not wanted to, to work on Christmas yet. I've been so on these journals here. Miss Jen. Hi, Miss Jen. Oh, yeah. I got a new iron. I got to do, I'm going to do a whole video about it. It's an iron. <laughs> so the iron I had for many, many years, I just like finally got so much, I finally got so much glue from, <laughs> from my usage of heat and bond. So I got a new one from Walmart, and I've been using that for a while, but you know what? I actually don't like it. I don't like it, and so I bought another one off Amazon. I liked it, but um, it was so heavy. It was just so heavy. Oh my, y'all know my hands are very weak and so, so heavy I could not use it. I mean, I tried to use it one time to iron, and I did, and I used it to iron some scraps, but my hand was, it hurt my wrist. Um, so I was just like, this is not going to work. So then I splurged, and I... <laughs> 
I got a ninety dollar iron, and I want. I haven't used it yet, but I want to get to it. It's a Panasonic. It's like some Panasonic cordless. It says Panasonic three hundred sixty freestyle cordless. Uh, cordless iron. And um, it's so light, and I love it. And uh, I can't. I need to use it. I need to try it out. Uh, so I'll probably do a live soon, trying it out. Um, I'm not, I'm gonna have to take care of it. So good. I don't want glue to get on this iron. So I'm already nervous about that. Like I have to cut everything <laughs> of the heat and bond, like to the right size because I don't want to get no glue on my iron. Okay, so here's the second pocket, but I'm just so excited about it because it's so light and also it's cordless. Technically it's cordless. It still does need to, uh, it has a base and the base is what attaches, is what goes on to the other, is what um, charges it. So it like basically gets it up to the right um, heat. Um, I'm not gonna put my other pocket here. Oh my goodness. So I'm excited about that. Oh, today I went to the, uh, today I went to the fancy buffet. <laughs> I went to this bougie little buffet. It was so cute actually. It was at the Wynn. Really pretty buffet, and uh, I eat like a 10 year old. <laughs> so mostly I get like mac and cheese and like potatoes and some meat and like pasta. <laughs> I eat like I am 10 years old, like honestly, that's the taste level I'm at right now. Um, but the mac and cheese was really good. It was so good. Everything I had was really good. Miss Beverly. Hi, Miss Beverly. I'm trying to get this pocket on here. But the iron is so cute. I really like it. Like it's I don't know why I find it adorable. But it's really cute. It's really cute. I am, I don't, I, you know how, I mean, I know I'm getting old because, like, I'm excited to try out an iron. <laughs> I'm excited for an iron now, so I'm officially old. Officially. Officially, my parents have started to, <laughs> officially, my parents have started to tell me how many gray hairs I have, so that's cute. <laughs> that's uh, fun. <laughs> um, let's see. This is too much. Clash is too much. Too much clash. I like it here. This pocket I made, this crazy pocket. It's not too many. I know, I feel, I feel old, y'all, like, I, it's, like, even worse, because, like, I didn't even buy this iron for clothes and nothing, I bought it for, like, bed sheet fabric, I'm cutting up, ah, <coughs> um, let's see here, <laughs> we're all old, Vanessa, now, every time I say I'm old, then we, everybody starts to fight about how old they are. <laughs> it's inevitable. Everybody's all of a sudden, everybody's got to be the oldest. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm stuffed, though. I'm stuffed. And then the dessert. Oh my God. The dessert table was on point. Everything I had was so good. My husband said it was overpriced. Probably because he paid. <laughs> and um, I loved it. Everything I had was delicious. Everything, everything was so good. They had a little creme brulee. I ate like two of them. 
They had ice cream. Oh, they had oh they had this really cute like little like cone, like this little cone that was like covered in chocolate. It was like a waffle cone, just the tip. Just the tip of the waffle cone, and it was covered in it was, it was covered in chocolate. Had chocolate in it. Where'd I go? I went to it's literally called the buffet. I went to the buffet at the win. At the win. It's a fancy, it's a fancy casino. <laughs> that I never go in and I've never eaten at. <laughs> but it's on my list of me and my hubby are like having a staycation type of deal. So I told him all these things that I wanted to do, like eat at the Gordon Ramsay uh, steakhouse. Oh, what else did we do already? Eat at Gordon Ramsay. Something else. I can't remember what else. But we're supposed to go to this buffet. We're supposed to go to this um thing called like the Omega. Something about the Omega, some store or something like that. Some like art attraction here in town. So we're basically doing like a staycation, but since there's no hurry, one weekend we'll do this, the next weekend we'll do that. So it's been really nice. It's been really nice. So like I said, we still have to go. Um, now we have to go to the Omega Mart. And I think we're supposed to go get massages at some point too. So all that's part of our little staycation that we're doing. Just because, you know, I want to go, I want to have fun, but, like, I don't feel like, like, if I went on vacation right now, like, I feel like it would cost us so much money. I don't want to go to California, because we always go to California. And, you know, everywhere I look at the news, and it just says, like, oh, this place is, like, everywhere is short on cars, everywhere is short on Uber, like, that just doesn't sound like fun to me. So I planned all these things and and we're having we're having some fun. Letitia, hi Letitia. What's going on, Daisy? You're not with Liz. Okay. As I sip my little lemongrass tea here. <laughs> it's getting bad. I've never had my hair girl, so this is this is a new type of uh old for me. <laughs> I'm actually, I'm actually getting old, okay? So I'm, like, kind of in shock. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, okay. So like I said, I, I'm pretty much, um, I pretty much use the same pages. Um, of course, some of the printables are different. And, of course, some of the book pages look different. Some of them have, like, uh, images where I don't really want to cover. And some of them uh, don't like these ones. So basically, I'm copying this layout. This journal is done, and I'm just kind of going to copy, like, oh, I'll have a little quote here. I'll have this little here. So it just kind of keeps my brain from having to think too much. It's already pretty much figured out for me. So I'm just copying that journal, of course. And I can't copy it exactly because I don't have, once I put down an embellishment, I mean, that's it, so... I do have plenty of embellishments for now. I say that now and I'm only five journals in, but for now I'm good. Embellishments. This goes over here. Sue, hi Sue. Is it is it Sue from Red Hut? Oh my gosh. Patricia Liz is timed out. She said hi. She will be back. Why is it? I just don't understand why I did that to me. Daisy, I have to pack up my car from where are you, oh, you're moving? Ooh. Are you moving? Where are you going? You bought a, you bought a new house? Did you buy a new mansion, Miss Jen? With all the money I'm paying you, you could buy like 10 mansions. <laughs> okay. I pay Miss Jen real good money, okay, y'all? She is top executive producer of my show here. 30 minutes up in our LL. No, I'm downsizing on purpose. You're downsizing. Oh, it's too much work sometimes, you know? I've never had a big place like this, and it's just it's a, it's a lot of work. Okay, so this goes here. And I'll 
over here. I want to put it here, I guess, kind of in the middle. I spent the morning cutting up these little memo pads because I needed more of these memo pads. I was out. I had literally had like five of them left. And then I also spent the morning cutting all these up here, all these little um, quote spots. I fell down my stairs and hubby said no more. Oh, God. Yeah, uh, I fell down. I remember when we got our house out here, the first house we have is two stories. And I never had a, I never been in a two story house. And I fell down a couple times. <laughs> I remember. That's not fun. That's never fun. Probably put this one here. It will be interesting. I'm going to take too much out. Do you see how I make a vintage thing, I mean, I think they're all kind of vintage. I mean, you know, like vintage newsprint here. This is an old, this is an old, uh, uh, music paper. And this is old book paper right here. And all these are all vintage images. Girl, I don't know how much more vintage you want me to get. I get, I feel like my, my stuff is pretty vintage, you know? Um, I don't like to ink stuff. I don't know if that's what you consider vintage. I don't like to ink stuff, though. So house could put for sale in a week. It'll sell. They said the market is hot, hot, hot right now. Hot, hot. My mom keeps threatening to sell my house, which is not nice of her. It stopped being, it stopped being funny about five jokes ago. I'm just like, what am I missing, Letitia? Like a vintage flower fabric. These are all vintage fabrics. And it's floral. And it's fabric. What do you mean? What do you mean? Girl. Girl, I'm shook right now that I am not vintage enough for Miss Letitia. I am shooketh. Shook it. This is also a vintage flower. Girl! That hurt. That hurt my feelings. <laughs> <coughs> Hi, Zena. Did I miss Zena? I don't remember seeing Zena's name. What did I miss? <coughs> it's all good, girl. Me too, actually. I have not gone. I didn't go live the last two days. It's like the week before my period, and I always get like moody, and I just want to be in bed. <laughs> and for some reason, the last couple days, I've been getting sleepy exactly at 10 o'clock. I don't know what it is, but the last two days, 10 o'clock came around, and I was just like, time to sleep. I don't know why. Don't know why. It's just that time. Did I miss it? Why am I not seeing Xena? Why can't I not go Xena? Why do I not see Zena? I don't see her at all. Y'all are messing with me? No, there she is. Okay. I see her name. Hi, Ms. Zena. I'm just like, why is everybody saying hi to Zena? I didn't see a Zena. Zena says I'm Zena. <laughs> you better start going live early then. I know. My life is a mess. My life is just a big old, big old mess right now. I'm trying to get back together. I'm trying to get back together. Oh, these little shoes are so cute. I love this image with the shoes. It's adorable. You got something to do in the morning, Zena? Why is everybody telling you to go to sleep, girl? Oh my 
early gig at one. Ooh, like 1 p.m.? <laughs> 1 p.m. or like... I mean, for me, that's pretty early, too. I mean, I would say that's early. Oh, I'm supposed to go to Monique's house tomorrow. I'm going to go hang out with Miss Misfit Crafta. I'm going to go decorate some journals at her house. That girl lives so far. My goodness. That girl lives out by the desert. Yeah. This is a city, and she lives out by the desert. So, <laughs> it's going it's to be a nice 30, 35, 40-minute drive. My girl, she lives out there. Who you got melatonin gummies? That's fancy. I just go to sleep. I don't know. I don't have any problems sleeping. I just sleep. The last thing I have issues with is so lately, like I said, I've been taking I've been taking like three naps a day. It's probably not good for me. But I have I've been taking like two, three naps a day and I'm sleeping still at night. Well, you could call it sleep. I just really take another four hour nap. I can never sleep like eight hours through. I just uh sleep. About four, five hours tops, so and then I wake up. That could be cute there. I'm just going to lay it on. Everybody, everybody's about to medicate. <laughs> everybody's about to get that mullet. Okay, so I now have a whole container of just like all sorts of different memo pads that I've been getting here and there. So that's a thing now. This one is just perfect for a couple spots, like this spot right here is just perfect for it. So we went to the buffet and then my husband wouldn't take me to Balenciaga and wouldn't buy me a purse. So I don't know what to do anymore. <laughs> we passed by Balenciaga. They had the like smallest little purses. I was like, you know that purse is like five thousand dollars. Stupid, just dumb. Like swap meat stuff. <laughs> but well, because it says Balenciaga, it's like a million dollars. Miss Liz, I don't know what's going on, bro. Oh my goodness, I have so many memo pads and I blame you. The addiction is real. I love my memo pads. I really do. I really, truly love my memo pads. They're the best. I'm going to start. I have some of these, like, bigger ones. I'm going to, like, fold them in half and just put them in pockets and stuff. You see, just like that, like. Or from the paper clip or something. These ones I got them from the dollar store, but they were like three dollars. I hate how the dollar store is doing you like that now. I want a Van Cleef and Arful Carmelian and Rose Gold necklace. That's a lot of that's a lot of uh SAT words there, Zena. You know what? <laughs> I don't I don't know her. I don't know Miss Van Cleef. I don't know then. I'm not a designer type of girl, to be honest with you. I'm not. <laughs> I'm just a regular girl. And I, I, don't, I can't afford to buy labels. And you know what? That's okay. <laughs> it's okay that I'm just a regular, regular 
bought it at Ross Girl. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay to be, uh, I got it at, at Ross. Tough girl, you know? <laughs> Oh, no, me either, but I have the boyfriend to buy that for me. That's funny. Show me a good time, buy me a premium car. So Beverly is like, I'm the cheapest date in them all. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what else? Like, the way I see it is like, honestly, like, even when I was, I can remember thinking back to college and being like well i'm an artist so i'm not gonna put somebody else's name on me like i am gonna wait till somebody wears my stuff on them like i'm not gonna wear nobody else's name so literally all my clothes are like plain I i'm so plain all of my clothes are like plain solid color clothing no brand name on them I, I, I don't wear things with the with the name brand. Like, I don't care what it is. I don't do it. It's just not me. It's just not for me. Okay, Miss Letitia, have a good day. The only thing I do get a little bougie with is my makeup. I do like a certain brand of makeup. And I'm pretty loyal to that brand, and they're not the cheapest, but they're also not like, it's not like Gucci makeup or nothing. <laughs> but that is one thing that I, like, I have to have my brand, name brand things, is like my makeup specifically. Um, everything else is from Walmart. <laughs> my mascara is from Walmart. I don't like to spend money on mascara. It's just, it's not. I don't think expensive mascara is any different from Walmart brand, but that's just me. I like MAC. I've always been a MAC girl since I was in my 20s. Now that I'm not in my 20s, <laughs> I always wear MAC makeup. And uh, here in Las Vegas, it's very easy to get it. I used to, I have so many colors, y'all, and I used to go crazy with my makeup, and just, like, lately, I just want to wear, like, nudes and browns, maybe a copper tone here and there. I don't know what happened to me. <laughs> I used to wear crazy green, purple, anything blue, and now I'm just like, mm, maybe a little brown. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know who I am anymore. <laughs> you know what? I'm not, you know what? I was into makeup, like very into makeup, but I never wear lipstick. I don't know why. I feel like my lips are so big and it just, it's just silly. It's just silly at that point. Like I got big old lips and then I put color. It's just, I just feel, I just feel silly. Honestly, I feel silly. So I just, I don't wear lipstick. I just wear a good old chapstick, girl. Good old chapstick. Ah, I can't, I, I don't like lip gloss. Mm -mm. I just want my chapstick. That's one thing I never did spend money on was um, lip products. I'm just not into lip products. I feel like I look silly. I don't know. It's just me. It's just me. It's just me. <laughs> it's just me. Oh, and you know what? I went to the dollar store a while ago. I haven't shown you because know, I wasn't decorating journals. But they had these post-its a while ago. And I spent like $25 on post-its. <laughs> this one's not new. But I bought these these ones. I, and, I, of course, I bought extra because these are super cute. You got these, like, little flowers on the corner, like little cross-stitch. I stick to neutrals for the most part, everyone. And then I do have a smoky eye. I do love me a smoky eye moment. And these are all post-it brands. They had like very, very post-it brand post-its at the dollar store. And they have these ones with these little, um, 
helium balloons. You want balloons on here? These are from the dollar store. Nine nine seven. I know. I did. I did. I spent twenty five dollars on Posey. These are all a dollar each, and there's like ten of them right here. It's ridiculous. <laughs> and there's these ones. They're a little bit plain, but I thought they were cute too. These are from the nine nine cent store. The um, all nine nine cent store. But again, that was a while ago, like a couple months ago, at least a couple months ago. Um, so I don't know if they still have them. Last time I went, they didn't have them, and I was like sad about it. I was so sad. I'm going to put one of these. When I did my makeup, everything was a smoky eye. I never did a non-smoky eye look. Everything was very smoky. But like I said, I just do brows now. I used to do crazy colors. Get out of here. And I have a lot of makeup still left. I don't think I'll ever use it. <laughs> don't ever buy a lot of makeup in your 20s, okay? Don't do it because... You'll have it forever. <laughs> you don't have the 99 cent store here, but you don't. Yeah, are you sure? Are you sure? Because that's crazy. That's weird. Yeah, I, that's why, honestly, I love living here. Everything that, oh, is, like, we pretty much have everything everybody else has, like, and it's close by. That's why I like the city. It's just too hot. <laughs> it's way too hot, y'all. I can't stand it. I hate it. <laughs> Yes, this little couch is adorable right here. And you only have Dollar Tree? Hmm. Hmm. The 99 cent store is the one that I remember going to as a child. <laughs> that thing's been here forever. I'm excited because new house is close to Sprouts. I love Sprouts. They have really good sausage there. They, they make their own sausage. And it's really good. Miss Beverly, have a good night, girlfriend. And then they have this bread. They have this round loaf. And it has like cheese and tomato tomatoes baked onto the top of it and I freaking love that bread. It's so good. Make sure to get one of those. Oh you're not she's like I'm sleepy but I'm not leaving. Excuse me, she says. I'm going nowhere. I'm so excited for these journals. They are coming together so nicely. I'm so proud of myself for not for not abandoning them for two years like I always do. <laughs> oh man, I was really into that. Just like starting journals. Oh, let me start some other journals. Oh, let me start some other journals. <laughs> I'm actually like finishing them. What itch? What a development of character I have shown. <laughs> okay, so we have this over here. And I've already done this, so I don't want to repeat it too many times. What else do I have? Oh, I still have this post-it. I literally have like three of them. 
Oh, how I wish I would have bought more of these at the time. I didn't know. <laughs> so sad. So sad when you run out of supplies. Thank you for noticing this, Jan. I've been really trying really hard. <laughs> I've been trying to really, actually I have 10 other journals that I need to finish, but I need to buy a camera. My camera is not working. Not my web camera. My regular camera that I use to take photograph for my listings. It's not working. So I have to buy a new one. So it's just like, ugh. Ugh. I hate when there's like obstacles, you know, to getting things done. That's so annoying. It'd be faster if I could just get it done. But no, can't just do that. Okay. So got this side of this page. Us old folk like passing for old age creep. Oh my goodness. I have like six videos. And I want to get an iPhone. I just, I don't want to pay for it. If I could just like get a free iPhone somewhere. <laughs> but now I'll just buy a new camera. It's the same thing. No, it's not. It's the same thing as an iPhone. No, no, it's not. You know what? The thing with me and iPhones is I have I've never had an iPhone. I've always wanted an iPhone. But it's just like uh, they decorated the glossy bag today. It came out cute. Ooh, post pictures. iPhones are cut for YouTube. Are they? Because I really thought that's what they were for, y'all. I thought that they would be good on YouTube. Are you serious right now? Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to freak out. <laughs> are you serious? They're not good for YouTube? I have six videos stuck. Stuck? What do you mean they're stuck? What I don't like, Xena, is the fact that, like, I, okay, here's the thing, okay, it just comes down to principle, okay, and I refuse to pay more for a phone than I paid for my computer. You see what I mean? That's what I'm opposed to. That's what I'm opposed to. My computer costs $600. And I use it every day and that it makes me money. I don't know if an iPhone is going to make me money. So therefore, <laughs> that it just doesn't make sense to me that an iPhone costs more than a computer. I just, I can't. I can't, it, can't, it doesn't make sense to me. I can't, I can't make it make sense. But I still want one. <laughs> but if someone was going to give me one for free, I wouldn't say no. <laughs> oh, I hear you. That's why I justified buying the Mac phone instead of the phone. The MacBook instead of them. That's what I'm saying. Like, I don't know. As much as uh, they're so cool, right? They're cool. <sighs> On my phone, all I do is check my, my Facebook and maybe some in my store. I, I can't justify it. I just can't justify it. Hi, Miss Monique. I gotta get, I, I have to decorate journals tomorrow, so I'm just gonna take my trays. So I hope you have a little bit of desk space for me because I need some desk space. <laughs> or let me know if you're limited on desk, desk space now and I'll figure something else to bring. Five feet, I think my table's five feet. Uh, let's uh, Jen says, I'm a lucky one that got the storage is full, even though it's only a quarter of the way full. It's a glitch that happens to some people. Oh, God. My phone right now, not an iPhone, but it's telling me, like, oh, this app is closed. Like, okay. Like, 
the shop is closed. Like, why do you keep telling me the shop is closed? Keeps telling me. There we go. We'll pick this, this right here. Right there. I've had nothing but problems picking your choice. Eight feet or five feet. Okay, okay. I'll let you know. When I get there. Oh, I have not gotten crafting at somebody's house in forever. I'm just like. I don't forget anything. That's what I don't like is forgetting stuff. <laughs> forgetting stuff? Oh no. And you're so far away. I have to like have somebody mail me the stuff over. I'm just kidding. <laughs> okay, this goes here. My hubby got me a webcam. There you go, Jen. That works. I want to get a better webcam. <sighs> Dreams. Dreams. Okay, let's see what we can put on this side. We'll put this thing right there. It's a Logitech one for stream. I love my Logitech stuff. I really only buy, I, I yeah, I really only buy Log, uh, Logitech webcams. And I like Logitech keyboards. I always get those Logitechs. Let's see. Get their streaming software too, Jen, on their website. It's pretty good. Pretty good. 1080 cool. Okay, okay, so that uh, was flowers and I need a bunch of flies. Let's see what I can put. Yeah, I think happy thoughts would be cute. Everything I get with my computer is Logitech. I get HP computers and keyboards. And this is Logitech as opposed to street. Oh, right. Um, once you have a thousand followers, I think it's like a thousand followers or something like a thousand watch hours, one of the two, then you can use Logitech's, uh, Logitech's program. So for now, I think you still have to use StreamYard because I don't know if you still, I don't know if you have the number of followers yet. Until you do, you will have to use StreamYard. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Once you get there, then you can just use the Logitech uh, software. Thanks. Okay, over here. Where did it go? Where did it go? I just had it. I had it not too long ago. The screen post it that I like to use. Where did it go? I only have a little bit of it left. Oh goodness. I only have a meltdown doing my journal scout, you know, 90% of the time. <laughs> there you go, Dan, you're getting there. Yeah, I've always liked Logitech stuff. It's a good brand. Their stuff lasts forever. There we go. Oh my god, there's children outside. Okay, this will go right here. I like using these just regular lined post-its. Okay. 
the Logitech that's compatible with my MacBook is two hundred dollars. That's that's not a bad price for a webcam, to be honest with you. I think I the most expensive I've, I've ever bought was like a hundred dollars or like one hundred and twenty-five. One of the two. One of those two. Don't know about it being compatible with a MacBook. I've never had to worry about that. <laughs> but um, that's also why I don't like MacBooks. And not that I have an option of buying one. <laughs> not that anybody is offering me one. But just for more. I've only, the only time I've ever worked with Macs was in college. And that's the one thing I didn't like was like, oh, if you buy a Mac, then this has to be special for the Mac, and that has to be special for the Mac, and that has to be. That was the one thing I was just like, oh, I'm just not used to that, you know? I'm not used to that at all. The cube looking one, the Logitech came out. I haven't kept up with them, but I know I want to upgrade. It's been like two years since I last bought a camera. Not that I need to, but I am not to. <laughs> I like to upgrade stuff every once in a while. Especially if it's work stuff. These children are yelling right outside my window. I don't like them because you need newer Macs because eventually you can't update them if they are getting old. I need one with a very long cord. Oh, that's a tall order, Monique. That is a tall order. That's why I like my setup where I have my stuff because my computer is like right in the right spot to i have two desks right so one is my actual like graphic design computer desk and in front of it i have my craft table so it's like my tower my computer's right there it just makes everything so much easier i don't know if my my computer was farther away because they don't make them with very long cords and if you try and get some sort of like cord extension you might end up messing with quality at some point. That's what I would be afraid of. Android and PC for me, right? Me too. Me too. This has a pocket. Apple are good. <laughs> whoa, whoa, Beverly, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, 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 Beverly. <laughs> that's that's a lot of words, Beverly. <laughs> <laughs> They're the industry standard. I can't be mad at them. They used to, um, well, I, I don't know who, I think they own Adobe. I don't know who owns Adobe. Anyways, Adobe used to have con um, conventions here in town. I used to work them. They used to give us lunch and breakfast. They used to, I mean, that's really nice. <laughs> That was really nice of them. They're just the industry standard. Though. That's why they cost so much because they're used by professionals. You know what I mean? They're used by professionals and so they cost more and they're all special. And so, you know. But I just don't need all that for what I do. I, I understand when it's necessary. But for me, for oh, me, I don't know. I never found myself to need something more powerful than just a regular computer. 
But like I said, there's jobs where it is, it's necessary. Like you need to have Mac. And I mean, if you got it like that, you might as well go with the best, honestly. Honestly, you, you should just go with the best if you got it like that. But I don't. <laughs> okay, let's look over here. I love my Android and my PC. See, that's what Monique said, and she works for Apple. <laughs> Don't tell Apple she said that. She will get she will get fired. <laughs> she will get fired. <laughs> oh no. I don't mean to laugh at it like that's funny, but like <laughs> just joking. <laughs> But you know what the one good thing about Apple? I always heard Apple stuff. It's like really hard to hack Apple. It's really hard to like get Apple viruses. It's a lot more easier, a lot more common to hack PC and to hack um, Microsoft products. So in a way, in a way, it's it's cool. <laughs> In a way, it's okay. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's uh, they, they make their code so difficult. So, so they keep everything so secretive. <laughs> it's hard. It's hard. I've heard, uh, yeah, it's possible. It is possible, but you know what? It takes a lot more effort. <laughs> it takes a lot more effort to do so. Um, and more, more so for viruses, you're protected more against viruses and on PC. Because there's less viruses for Macs. Uh, I love using the iPad for Photoshop. I have never in my life used an iPad for Photoshop. I don't even know how that would work. I don't know how that's even possible. I'm so used to using mouse and keyboard. <laughs> Oop! <laughs> Sorry, y'all. That was that was the buffet from earlier coming up. My bad. <laughs> I went hang up. I went. <laughs> I'm watching you on my iPad. See, and she's not getting hacked. So Jen just proved this right. I have never once had a legitimate virus call. See, I knew it. That's what I've always heard <clears throat> from way back in the day. That it's just, it just doesn't happen. It just don't happen. Here we get a stamp. They are the best with accessibility features. I have an iPad and I just, I basically use it as my television. <laughs> when I'm on my computer, that's like my TV. When I'm doing something on my computer and I got my little iPad, and that's my TV. I do like the iPad, but that's it. Okay, there. Boop. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. He's so funny. The other day, like he was huffing and puffing. He was by his toy that's on the door. He was huffing and puffing to turn it on and turn it on. And I was like, I can't remember what I was doing. I was like busy with something. I think I was playing like a video game or something. I was just like, hang on, hang on, hang on. And he was huffing and puffing. And then I. <laughs> And then I finally go over there to turn it on, and this boy, when I turn it on, he goes and he sits down and he's like, it's too late now, I don't want to play with it. <laughs> I draw on my iPad too. I've never tried to draw on an iPad. Let's see if I can get rid of these. This one. Happy 
this is an inside job. See, right now he's sick. He, you guys, he has me like wrapped around his finger. I am his like little servant person. And he's a little rich boy. He's a little bougie boy. And he just looks at his toy for five minutes and expects that I know what he wants. Oh, okay, boo boo. Okay, he's just standing over there looking at his toy and then meowing back at me like, you know what you do. You know what I want. Such a bossy little boy, boo boo. Why are you such a boxy boy? <laughs> He's so silly. I'll turn it on. I got four minutes on the clock, boo boo. You gotta wait because that thing is so loud and distracting. It's kind of annoying. Okay, you gotta wait a minute. Oh my god. You see what I'm saying, you guys? He's doing that because I haven't turned on his toy and he's over there by it. Don't, boo boo. Don't do it. We got this over here. I don't want to really cover that up, actually. I don't. Psst, don't scratch at my door. I don't think so. That's what we're not going to do today. I'm telling you, this little boy. I'm um, his little servant over here. And his little throw arm. I'm telling you. <clears throat> what would you do if I had a job, Boo Boo, and I had to leave the house? What would you do, Boo Boo? You don't even know what you would do. Boo Boo's like, Mommy, I want my toy now. <laughs> exactly. He's just like, I want it off now. <laughs> Don't be a bossy boy, Boo Boo. Don't do it. Let's see. Good. He's going to go look out the window. <laughs> Keep yourself busy with that. Okay, you guys, but I'm pretty much done here for tonight. Um, I do want to come on live tomorrow. I want to show off my iron. <laughs> what a weird thing to say. But, <laughs> but I do want to show off my iron tomorrow. So hopefully I do. Um, okay, tomorrow. No, tomorrow I'm going to go to Monique's house. I can't tomorrow. Maybe Sunday. Maybe Sunday, I'm thinking. I'll show off the iron. I just wanna see how it works. I haven't tried it myself, so I wanna do like a like a first impressions type of thing. But anyways, you guys, I hope everybody had a good day today. Thank y'all so much for joining me tonight. Um like I said, I've been kind of slow lately and uh sometimes I don't wanna come into my craft room. <laughs> It's just the moody week before my period. It, I get like that sometimes. But anyways, I hope everybody has a good day. I hope everybody has a good weekend. I will see everybody back on Monday. Um, if I don't go live on Sunday. Um, but I'll come back on Monday and I'll go live. And uh, we will probably be continuing on working on these journals. Because I don't know how many I'm going to get done over the weekend. But I have 12 to do. So yay. Thank you guys so, so much for your companionship and for hanging out with me. I will chat with y'all on Monday. If I don't get to my life on Sunday, don't quote me on that. But anyways, you guys, I hope everybody has a good day. Have a good weekend. Okay, you guys, bye. See you tomorrow, Monique. Bye.